Taco Bar Catering presents to you our original taco bar from our taco bar menu. So we made some slight changes this year in regards to what's included in our original taco bar. And we bring the changes to you. I know you guys will love it. Uh, we added some special features to it, uh, some well-known features to it. So enough talking, let me go into the details. Uh, we got some refried beans here. Uh, you guys get to choose. We got refried and black beans. You guys get some Mexican authentic rice for your package. And you guys get to choose from the following, uh, we have five choices of meat you guys get to choose from. So uh, you get to choose three of those. Uh, what we have featured here in this video, we got the grilled chicken, we got the steak, we got the ground beef, and trust me guys, this is real ground beef. There's nothing to worry about. There's nothing, any speculation whether it's real meat or not, like other restaurants that we know of, right? Uh, no, this is real authentic meat. Uh, you guys get the authentic chips here too. We make these chips at home. Uh, everything's made from scratch. Another thing too that's included in your package it's a corn and flour tortilla. So the longer ones are going to be the flour, the shorter ones are going to be the corn tortillas. And the condiments included in this package is going to be the red salsa, the green salsa, the cilantro, the onion, the tomato, the limes, the cheese, the sour cream, and the lettuce. You guys may wonder, why do we need the cilantro, cheese, and lettuce, right? Well, this is a new feature in our package is that we're offering you guys in this package the crispy tacos. So we were featured in the OC register for our crispy tacos. That's what we wanted to include it in our package, in our original package. And now what I'm gonna do next is show you guys how to build the perfect crispy taco with our taco bar catering standards, all right? So uh, personal preference of mine, uh, I just, obviously we start with the shell. Uh, I like to start off with the meat. Uh, I personally like just the, the ground beef. It's just it's so tasty, so authentic. Um, so much flavor in it. I like to put the cheese on after. The reason I put the cheese on after is because what I do after the cheese is I add, add beans. That allows it, the cheese to melt as you add the rest of the toppings and it just gives a different flavor once the cheese is melted. So after that, I like to add some lettuce to my taco. Some tomato. Oops. Some tomato. Some cremita. And I personally don't like the red salsa. So after you build your taco, not only can you build a crispy taco, but you guys can also build a soft, authentic taco. I mean, so authentic tacos are pretty simple, guys. It's just the meat. To me, the most authentic taco you can get is just the meat, right? The meat, the cilantro, onions and you gotta put some some limon on there. Limon is what makes it different. And this time we'll go with the green sauce. The green, the green sauce is a little milder than the other ones. So you guys get to build from both of these. We got the crispy tacos, we got the authentic soft tacos and don't mind me guys, I'm about to dig in. I've been doing work all day and I'm hungry now. Enjoy it. 